We're continuing our journey through the Sermon on the Mount in prayer. And tonight's passage comes from Matthew 5, 13 through 16. I'm going to read you the Eugene Peterson translation in the message. Let me tell you why you're here. You're here to be salt seasoning that brings out the God flavors of this earth. If you lose your saltiness, how will people taste godliness? You've lost your usefulness and will end up in the garbage. Here's another way to put it. You're here to be light, bringing out the God colors in the world. God is not a secret to be kept. We're going public with this, as public as a city on a hill. If I make you light bearers, you don't think I'm going to hide you under a bucket, do you? I'm putting you on a light stand. Now that I've put you there on the hilltop on a light stand, shine. Keep open house. Be generous with your lives. By opening up to others, you prompt people to open up to God, this generous Father in heaven. Let us pray. I invite you to breathe in and release your breath. And I want those words to shine in you. Say them over. Salt, light, flavor, color. Salt, light, flavor, color. Salt, light, flavor, color. Salt, light, flavor, color. Holy One, we're to be salt flavoring, making it possible to bring out the fullness of flavor. Help us to provide what is needed for people to thrive, to help people discover what gives them life, fulfillment, happiness. We're to be salt, preserving, making it possible for everything to last a little longer. Help us to preserve life, to bring food to the hungry, to bring water to the thirsty, to bring healing to the sick, to bring freedom to the oppressed. We are to be light. Light to shine where there is violence, danger, travail. Be with those little black girls afraid of the police this week, fearing that they will be beaten and pepper sprayed. Be with the farmers in India who are fighting for their way of life. Be with those whose homes are full of violence. Be with anyone having to flee their home or country because of danger. Where to be light? So we can see and know and understand. Light our path that we may discern the way forward. Light our path that we may see the truth. The facts, the reality before us. Holy One, there are so many people and situations on our mind. Families whose loved one has died. Families who are having to make tough, hard decisions about how to live the rest of their life. Families who are struggling to pay the bills and the rent, to buy food for their family. There is so much grief and sorrow right now. Surround us with your flavor and color. Help us to be salt and light, flavor and color. Help us to shine. Amen.